Hey, how's it going? It's Stephen here from understandingaudio.com with part three of my mini series on how to produce music with Expand. Now, the whole point of this mini series is to show you that you can create great music by just using the stock instruments that come with your DAW. In the case of Pro Tools, the stock instrument that comes with that is Expand by Air Music Technology, so that's what I'm using to demonstrate. In parts one and two, I covered drums, pads, and chords. And in this video, I'm gonna be talking about bass. So let's get to it. The bass part that I've played in down here is really simple. All it is is the root notes of the chords, so it's A, F, C, G. I've just gone with some long held notes to complement what we already have, but now I need to find my bass sound, so let me do that. If I click into expand, come up here to the top and go through synth basses to start with. Let's see if we can find a good one. Foot to the floor. Let's go with that. So let me just mute the click track and play this back. Okay, it's a bit much for me. So let's try and find something a bit more mellow, round and deep. Right. That's a bit too farty for me. Oh, speaking of farty, let's try broken toilet. Yeah, that, that definitely sounds like uh, a broken toilet. Um, pulsating vocal fuzz. Yeah, too much again. Pretty cool sound. Let's see what else we got. The lonely guy, like the guy in a room on his own talking to a microphone. Just looking at the info on this one. This could only be loved by a physics master. Do not play near sleeping cats. Well, I am not a physics master and I don't have any cats. Uh, so I guess that's me out of this one. But in all seriousness, there were some nice sounds in there in the synth basses, but none of them really complemented the other elements all that well. The only thing I liked about this Lonely Guy synth is the fact that there is a nice bit of attack on it. So I'm going to see if I can try and find that in a more natural sounding bass rather than using a synth bass. So I'll go in here and see what I can find. Try this Funk Hits the Fan. That sounds pretty cool. Let's see what that sounds like. Okay, that sounds pretty cool. This gives me that low end lift I'm looking for without dominating too much. So I think it should be pretty clear that if you play around just a little bit with this plugin and with the instrument that you have within your own DAW, you can find the sounds that suit your music and the style that you're working in really quickly. Even though some sounds are pretty cool, like the broken toilet sound, they might not exactly suit what you're trying to do straight away. So there's a little bit of back and forth and a little bit of thinking and using your taste to get you to where you want to go. Now, there are a few more parts of this mini series that I'm going to go through. And the next one is going to be really important because we're going to be talking about synth leads. And because you've taken the time to watch this video and like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't done that already, do that now. And you subscribe to the channel, do that as well. I want to give you something completely for free today as a thank you from me. Now, I spoke about adding in elements based on how it suits the sound and based on your taste. And my free gift to you is all about that. It's my free guide, the one hack that guarantees a unique pro sounding mix. Within that guide, you're going to find all sorts of information to unlock your taste and use it to your advantage so that your mixes take on a whole new professional sound and you get the same results like all of my subscribers over at understandingaudio.com. And if you're not subscribed over there yet, go and subscribe now. You get all sorts of free stuff like this every single week. Now to download the guide, all you need to do is go to getpromixes.com and it's yours absolutely for free today. 
thank you once again for taking the time to watch this video today. Uh, again, if you enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Keep having fun, making great music, and I'll be back with part four of this mini-series very soon.